My name is John Parkin, I'm with Team 16, and today I'll be talking about our gallery room. We came up with three criteria that will influence the design of the Gravisnet. Those criteria being hand detection, which is the mech which will control the mechanism that will tell the grab a snack to dispense snacks into your hand. Snack dispensing, which is which will be the mechanism that pulls the, the snack out of the dispenser and pours it into the hand. And then method of power delivery, which will simply be what powers the grab a snack. Starting with hand detection, our first option was a light sensor, which will detect the change in light levels uh, caused from the customer inserting their hand into the compartment. And then uh, we also have an ultrasonic sensor here, which will detect the change in distance from the customer inserting their hand into the compartment. And then finally, we have a tactile switch, which is a simple push button that the customer will hit with their finger once they put their hand into the compartment and then dispensing the snacks from there. For snack dispensing, we have a slotted wheel down here that will simply fill up with snacks from the compartment and once activated, turn and pour the snack right into the customer's hand. We have it next. We have a flap controlled by a servo motor down here, which will, once activated, just simply open for a set amount of time, freely pouring snacks into the, the customer's hand and until closed. And then we have an Archimedes screw, which will turn once activated, turn and pull snacks right right from the container into the customer's hand. For methods of power delivery, we have a simple nine volt battery, which will be uh, held right in the back of the grab a snack. Uh, providing power, making it easy and convenient for the customer to place anywhere within their home. And then we have a wall out outlet option, which is just another option for power delivery and in the long run it would save money through power consumption. And then this led to me designing two different sketches using some of these options. So for the first one, utilizes a, a light sensor, the flap, and the battery. And I have a simple open front view showing that the light sensors will be put on the bottom of, of the grab a snack with the motors and flaps opening freely from the compartment with controlled by the battery and Arduino board in, in the back. And for my second design, I have the ultrasonic sensor, the slide wheel, and the wall outlet option. Again, with the ultrasonic sensor being on the bottom to detect when the hand goes in, the wheel would be in between the compartment and and the snack container, and then it's all again controlled by the Arduino, but this time it's plugged right into a pow uh, the wall outlet. And then this led to, to us coming up with our two main designs, utilizing a light sensor, flap, and battery, and the second one being ultrasonic sensor, wheel, and battery. These will be our designs going forward.